What's up, everybody? This is Tech G back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to be explaining to you what a network analyst is in case you want to pursue this as a career. So let's get into it. All right. So in this video, we're going to talk about all of this wonderful stuff on your screen. I'm going to describe what a network analyst is, how much money they make, their roles, their responsibilities, the skills, tools, how important they are, and how long it's going to take for you to become a network analyst if this is what you want to do. A network analyst, this is an IT professional who specializes in the design, installation, monitoring, maintenance, and security of an organization's computer network infrastructure. This includes local area networks, wide area networks, intranets, and extranets. And network analysts, they work closely with network administrators, engineers, and IT support staff to ensure that a company's network operates efficiently and reliably, allowing employees to communicate and access resources effectively. Also, network analysts focus not only on the hardware components of networks such as routers, switches, and cables, but also on the software that controls data transmission. And they are often tasked with diagnosing and resolving network performance issues, implementing network upgrades, and ensuring the security of network communications. All right, so let's quickly talk about how much money a network analyst makes. So the average annual salary for a network analyst in the United States is approximately $71,000 with a typical range between $63,000 and $80,000 per year. However, salary estimates can vary across different sources. So for instance, the website Payscale, they report an average salary of about $65,000 a year with a range from $49,000 to $97,000. Glassdoor, estimates an average base salary of about $76,000 with total compensation around $95,000 per year. And Indeed reports an average salary of about $99,000 per year plus a $3,000 cash bonus. So these variations, they highlight the influence of factors such as experience, location, and industry that affect the compensation. All right, so let's talk about the role of a network analyst. So the role of a network analyst, this can vary depending on the size and type of organization they work for. In smaller companies, network analysts may wear multiple hats, handling various IT responsibilities beyond just network management. In larger organizations, their work may be more specialized, focusing solely on network analysis, troubleshooting, and optimization. And here are some of the core responsibilities of a network analyst. So the first one is network design and implementation. So one of the primary responsibilities of a network analyst is to design and implement network systems that meet specific needs of an organization. And this includes determining the network architecture, such as LAN, WANs, and intranets, selecting appropriate network devices like routers, switches, firewalls, and load balancers, planning the layout of cables, wireless access points, and other hardware components components, ensuring network scalability to accommodate future growth, and implementing VPNs and remote access solutions. There's also network monitoring and performance optimization. So once a network is in place, network analysts continuously monitor its performance to ensure it meets the organization's needs. And this involves using network monitoring tools to track traffic, bandwidth usage, and data flow, identifying potential bottlenecks or performance issues, analyzing trends in network traffic to anticipate future capacity needs, implementing load balancing techniques to distribute traffic evenly across the network, and adjusting network settings or upgrading hardware to improve performance. There's also troubleshooting and issue resolution. So network analysts that play a key role in diagnosing and resolving network problems that can disrupt business operations. And this may involve responding to alerts from network monitoring systems, diagnosing the root cause of network outages or slowdowns, repairing or replacing faulty hardware, working with vendors to resolve software or hardware compatibility issues, and testing and deploying patches or firmware updates to address unknown vulnerabilities. Then there's the issue of dealing with network security. So security, this is a critical aspect of any network analyst role. The network analyst, they are responsible for ensuring that the organization's network is secure from external threats and unauthorized access. And their duties in this area include configuring firewalls, intrusion detection systems, and intrusion prevention systems, implementing encryption protocols for secure data transmission, monitoring network traffic for suspicious activity, enforcing access control policies to ensure that only authorized users can access sensitive data, 
performing regular security audits and vulnerability assessments, and collaborating with cybersecurity teams to implement advanced security measures. Also, as a network analyst, you're going to find yourself doing some documentation and reporting. So maintaining accurate documentation is an important part of a network analyst job. And this includes documenting network configuration, settings and infrastructure changes, keeping records of network outages, issues and resolutions, creating network diagrams and performance reports from management and IT teams, and preparing documentation for compliance with industry regulations and standards. And then there's collaboration with other IT teams. So network analysts, they often work closely with other IT professionals, including network administrators, system administrators, and cybersecurity experts. And collaboration is essential for tasks such as coordinating software and hardware upgrades that impact the network, working with application developers to optimize network performance for specific software, implementing backup and disaster recovery plans, and participating in cross-functional IT projects that involve network infrastructure. So to excel in this role, a network analyst needs a combination of technical, analytical, and interpersonal skills. And here are some of the key skills and qualifications that are necessary for success. So the first is that of having technical knowledge of networking protocols and technologies. So a network analyst must have a deep understanding of networking protocols, such as TCP IP, which is the foundation of internet and intranet communication. You need to know about DNS, and this is the protocol that is used to transfer translate domain names into IP addresses. You need to know about DHCP. This is a protocol for automating the assignment of IP addresses. You need to know about various routing protocols such as OSPF, which stands for Open Shortest Path First, and BGP, which stands for Border Gateway Protocol. And you need to know about switching protocols such as VLANs and STP, which stands for Spanning Tree Protocol. Additionally, a network analyst should also be familiar with a range of technologies and tools, including Ethernet and wireless wireless networking, firewalls, VPNs, and network security devices, network monitoring tools like Wireshark, SolarWinds, and PRTG, and network management platforms like Cisco DNA Center or Juniper MIST. Another skill that you need to possess is that of problem solving and analytical skills. So network analysts, they must be skilled problem solvers who can diagnose and resolve complex network issues quickly. Analytical skills are also crucial for interpreting network data, identifying trends, and making informed decisions about network improvements. You also need to have attention to detail. So given the complexity of modern networks, even small configuration errors can cause significant problems. And network analysts, they need to have excellent attention to detail to ensure that networks are configured correctly and that issues are properly diagnosed. You need to have some strong communication skills. So network analysts often need to explain technical concepts to non-technical stakeholders, such as managers or end users. And strong communication skills are essential for writing clear documentation, reporting on network performance, and working with other teams. You also need to be able to manage your time and do some multitasking. So networks are critical to business operations and issues can arise at any time. Network analysts, they must be able to prioritize tasks effectively, manage multiple projects simultaneously, and respond to network emergencies promptly. Also, you're going to need to have some certifications. So while this is not always mandatory, network analysts, they can benefit from obtaining industry certifications that demonstrate their expertise. And some common certifications for network analysts include the following. You have the Cisco Certified Network Associate or the CCNA. And this focuses on networking fundamentals and basic routing and switching. You have CompTIA's Network Plus, and this covers a broad range of networking concepts and technologies. You have the CISSP or the Certified Information System Security Professional. This is a valuable certification for network analysts that is focused on security. Then you have the CMP or the Certified Network Professional, and this offers advanced training in network management and troubleshooting. All right, next, let's talk about some tools and technologies that are used by network analysts. So network analysts, they use a variety of tools and technologies to monitor, manage, and troubleshoot networks. And here are some common tools and their purposes. The first one is that of network monitoring tools. So we have tools like SolarWinds Network Performance Monitor, and this is a widely used tool for real-time network monitoring and diagnostics. You have the PRTG Network Monitor. This is a versatile tool for monitoring network performance, uptime, 
time and bandwidth usage. And then we have Wireshark. This is a powerful network protocol analyzer that allows analysts to capture and inspect packets in real time. Then there are some configuration management tools such as Cisco DNA Center, and this is a centralized platform for managing and optimizing Cisco-based networks. You have a management tool called Puppet, and this is an automation tool that helps manage network configurations and ensure consistency across devices. Do you have a tool called Ansible? This is another automation tool that simplifies network configuration tasks and management. And here are some security tools that network analysts use. So you have firewall solutions like Cisco, ASA, and Palo Alto. And these are used to control traffic based on predefined security rules. You have intrusion detection systems like Snort. And these are tools that detect and alert on potential security threats in the network. Do you have VPN solutions like OpenVPN and Cisco AnyConnect? And they provide secure remote access to network resources. All right, so moving on, let's talk about the importance of network analysts in modern IT environments. So in today's increasingly digital world, network analysts, they play a vital role in ensuring that organizations remain connected, secure, and operational as businesses continue to adopt cloud computing, remote work, and IoT technologies. The demand for skilled network analysts is expected to grow. So within that, we have ensuring business continuity. So network downtime, this can have serious consequences for any organization leading to lost productivity, missed opportunities, and even revenue loss. And network analysts, they help prevent these issues by monitoring network performance and proactively addressing potential problems before they escalate. Then we have enhancing security. So with the growing prevalence of cyber attacks and data breaches, network security is more critical than ever. The network analysts, they play a key role in securing the network infrastructure by implementing firewalls, intrusion detection systems, and encryption protocols calls and their work helps protect sensitive data and ensures compliance with industry regulations. And then they also support digital transformation. So as organizations undergo digital transformation initiatives, network analysts are essential in ensuring that new technologies are integrated smoothly into existing networks, whether it's moving to the cloud, implementing IoT solutions, or supporting remote work. Network analysts ensure that the network can handle increased demands. All right, so let's talk about the timeline that it's gonna take for you to become a network analyst. So becoming a network analyst, this typically takes about two to five years, depending on an individual's educational and professional pathway. So if you go the educational route, you're looking at about one to four years, and you can get an associate's degree in IT or networking, and that can take you about two years, or you can get a bachelor's degree in computer science, information technology, or some other related field, and that could take you about four years, but it may not be mandatory for all roles. If you choose to go get a certification, this can take you anywhere between three to 12 months. So you can get a certification like CompTIA Network Plus or CCNA or some Microsoft certification. These can all be earned within a few months to a year, and they are often required for entry-level roles. Then there's the experience route, when this can take you about six months to three years. So gaining relevant work experience, such as an IT support or network technician role, this can take about six months to three years, depending upon job opportunities and skill development. So the timeline can vary, but dedicated efforts combining education, certification, and hands-on experience, this can enable someone to enter the field in as little as two years. So to wrap all of this up, the role of a network analyst is integral to the smooth operation of any organization that relies on computer networks. And these professionals ensure that networks are designed, implemented, and maintained efficiently and securely. From troubleshooting network issues to optimizing performance and safeguarding against cyber threats, network analysts are at the forefront of modern IT infrastructure. So with the right combination of technical skills, problem-solving abilities, and industry certifications, network analysts can enjoy enjoy a rewarding and in-demand career. And as businesses continue to adopt more advanced technologies, the need for skilled network analysts will only continue to grow, making it a promising career path in the field of information technology.